Hey there, TRW crew, Matt Masalo here with the rhinestoneworld.com. In this quick tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to customize this coffee mug with some bling anything material and glitter heat transfer vinyl made for shirts without having to use any type of special mug or mug press. Pretty awesome video. Stick around to see how. Okay, so I have our change the world be a teacher design that I'm going to put on the mug. I'm going to use three colors of glitter heat transfer vinyl, black, royal blue, and red. I'm going to put them all on this mug right here. And then I'm going to use my bling anything material. And the reason for me using the bling anything material is instead of the sign vinyl, I want the glitter to look really, really good for this mug. But using the bling anything material will make it dishwasher safe as well, which is pretty amazing. So as you know, with the sign vinyl, sometimes it'll start to peel off over time. You can't put it through the dishwasher. Even the oils from your hands will eventually have it peel off. I want this mug to last. So we're going to use the bling anything material and three colors of glitter heat transfer vinyl. So first thing we need to do is get the design sent over to the cutter. We need to cut our heat transfer vinyl. Then we'll head over to the press. We'll press it and apply it. All right, so we have our design right here in the software. And I'm using CorelDRAW on the TRW Design Wizard. But this file can be an SVG format. It can work in Designer Edition, any of the different cuttable softwares out there. So in our software, to do our color separations, I'm going to click on our templates. I'm going to do a vinyl overcut. Now, what's great about our software, the TRW Design Wizard, is it automatically color separates it. It automatically saves as much material as possible, and it automatically mirrors it for you as well, which is pretty freaking cool. And then it's also going to do what we call a vinyl overcut feature, which is going to make the weeding process a whole lot easier because it's actually going to finish the cut, start the cut another quarter inch without the blade lifting up, and that's why all of our designs weed so easy. So let's get these sent over to the cutter, cut this, weed this, and get this mug made. Okay, so now that we have our three different cuts of our glitter heat transfer vinyl, it's time to take this, our bling anything material here. We're going to apply the heat transfer vinyl to the bling anything material. And then it's going to be a sticker that we can press on the mug and it's dishwasher safe. Okay, so I have my heat press set at about 305 degrees here. I have my protective cover sheet, my bling anything material. Now with the bling anything material, there's a shiny side and a non-shiny side. I'm going to apply it to the shiny side. So I'm going to start with my outside layer here. So this is the black. I'm going to go ahead and put this down. Fold my cover sheet over here real quick. Press this down for about two to three seconds and lift up. Now I'm just going to peel off my carrier sheet and my first part of my material is applied. Now I can come back with whichever color I want and just line it up. So now I'm going to come back with my blue. Everything's going to line up perfectly because I did that quick press there, just that two to three second press. And you can see how everything lines up perfectly there for us. So let's drop this down, fold it over. And again, we're going to do a two to three second press on this one. So drop it down, one, 1,000, two, 1,000, up. Now remember, if you're doing sign vinyl, you're still going to have, I'm doing multiple presses here, but with the sign vinyl, I'm going to have multiple layers with all of our registration marks. So there's always going to be that extra work, but with this, what we're really getting out of it is the real, real good glitter, and then also we are going to get it to be dishwasher safe. So coming back with my last piece here, boom, looks good to go. And then on my last press, I'm gonna go for about four to five seconds. One, 1,000, two, 1,000, and up. Let's go ahead and take this off here, peel off our carrier sheet, and you can see now we have 
our finish decal here. Okay, so now that we have that done, all we're going to do, we could have cut this with our vinyl cutter ahead of time, but because this material is so clear, and it only takes about 30 seconds, just depending on how complex you want to get with the trimming, I'm just going to trim around the edge of this. So remember, our Bling Anything material is a very, very clear material. So it's really hard to see once it goes on the mug anyway. And it's a lot harder to line everything up if I cut it ahead of time. And I've done all the testing on that already. So I'm just trimming around here, trim around the edge. And you can get as close as you want. I'm just going to get within probably a quarter inch of my edges here. Because remember, what this did is it actually created a decal. And this is an adhesive that all of this is on. So just trimming around the top of my apple here. Get that all good there. Trim back around this back side here. Back around the top. You want to get close, but you don't need to get so close that you cut into the material because, again, the material is so clear. And that's what's so awesome about the Bling Anything material. And there's some materials out there that aren't nearly as clear and they're very cloudy. That's why we go with this material. So check that out. And look at the sparkle on that. So now what we want to do is we want to apply this to our mug here. So I'm thinking right-handed, it's gonna be facing out that way. So I'm gonna apply this right here. So all we need to do, and this is how we would sell it to the customer right here. That's what's awesome about it, is it's ready to hand to the customer. So all the customer needs to do is pull this material up from the edge right here. And that's what's gonna expose our adhesive. So you can see we have our adhesive right here and now it's time to just line up this mug. So I'm going to get the mug here. Let's get all of this lined up perfectly. That looks good right there. I'm going to say that looks pretty straight, just like a shirt. I'm good with pretty straight. And boom, we got ourselves a finished mug. Just pushing down on the edges there. And we're good to go. Check it out. Change the world. Be a teacher. And what's really cool about it is some of the glitter sparkles you can see even get on the edge there. And it actually just adds more glitter to it, which looks pretty awesome. So this mug right here, not a sublimation mug, never touched the heat press. And this mug is now ready to go and it is dishwasher safe. Pretty awesome. All right, so there we go, guys. We just completed this mug. Turned out awesome, and I can put this in the dishwasher. That's the amazing part about it. With the signed vinyl, you aren't going to be able to do that. So this is something really unique that we came up with about a year ago, and a lot of people have been using it lately, and I love it. I love seeing the videos out there, and I love seeing the products out there showing it because I think it's a pretty amazing product that you can sell and make some pretty awesome margins on. So again, glitter heat transfer vinyl with our Bling Anything material. I will put the links to all the products that we used here in the description below. Please click the like button if you like this video and it gave you some new ideas. Comment below, let me know what you think about this mug. And of course, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for a lot of amazing videos just like this one here. Thanks for watching guys. You guys have an amazing day.